Starting this match in three, two, one, go! Our tiebreaker match in a very competitive semifinal. The same strategy playing out here that we saw in the first two semifinal mode matches. Five preloaded cargo pods for the Red Alliance. Five null hatch panels for the Blue Alliance. Before the sandstorm period ends, the Red Alliance are able to place two hatch panels in front of preloaded cargo. That'll be where they combine 10 points. Their three other preloaded cargo pods all spill out onto the field. We have a bad move on the Red Alliance. Already we had a robot of the Red Alliance on the other side of the field. Symbotics playing defense. However, Team Robotics crosses that cargo ship line. Only one robot may enter the opposing alliance's side of the field. That right there drawing flag waves from our referees. T minus 100 seconds remaining, two point edge for the Red Alliance. But as soon as I say it, the Blue Alliance takes it back. We're tied 47 points apiece. We're seeing a similar strategy from the Southington Cyber Knights. They're relatively unopposed as they shuttle between their depot and their loading station, stowing cargo and placing hatch panels into a Blue Alliance rocket. A different configuration for the Red Alliance. They have swapped out Trident Robotics for Team Robotics out of Highland, Michigan. Team Robotics now playing defense against Robo Jackets. OP Robotics of the Red Alliance working hard on their rocket. They've got four hatch panels and three cargo pods. Symbotics facing defense from the Force team like they have the past two matches. Symbotics seems to be learning the tricks that the Force team have up their sleeves, however. They're not having nearly as much trouble getting around that defense as they did in the earlier matches. T minus 40 seconds remaining. Blue Alliance with a five point edge, 74 to 69. Adding three more points, we've got the Cyber Knights out of Southington with another pod in the cargo ship. 30 seconds remaining in the match. Teams beginning to think about their end game strategies. OP Robotics looks like they're coming in for one last cargo pod for a Red Alliance rocket to be fully loaded. This is the end game period. A hard hit by the Force team. OP Robotics not able to place their last cargo pod. Six seconds to go, a big move for the Red Alliance. Team Robotics already on level three of the ham, but a Symbotics climb knocks them down. On the Blue Alliance, we a score of 106 to 98. The Blue Alliance pulls off a massive upset victory to win the match and move on to the Curie Finals.